Access to justice for children is at the heart of Defense for Children International in Sierra Leone. One of the things that we are actually promoting now is intergenerational partnership. This is because we want to understand how people from different generations experience the justice system and the world at large. Intergenerational partnership is important to ensure that we can really achieve a more comprehensive and sustainable legal transformation. And this can drive us towards generational equity. Really reforming our justice system or rethinking the way we deliver justice in this country. Really crucial part of this process has been how we redefine child justice, how we reform our juvenile justice system, you know, how we put our children at the center of our investment in child rights. And that is why we have been very deliberate in working with DCI as an institution which has been in this space for very many years, you know, and which Yaman continues to work with children across this country because we really want that intergenerational partnership. We are in one, um, the Ministry of Justice is collaborating with DCI and then through this collaboration, through this partnership, we're ensuring that um, um, children actually participate in the reform process um, um, that we are driving in this country. That way, we are not only sharing information with them, you know, they are not only listening, but they are actually active participants in all um, um, of the discussions that we, that we, that we get on, on, on reform process and, you know, and how we build the reform it, it, itself, you know, and that is how we have approached um, the development of the justice sector reform strategy, which, as I said, you know, has a significant component on child rights and child justice. Um, children have been part of this conversation, and as we implement this strategy or these aspects of the strategy, we will make sure that this partnership with DCI continues. We will make sure that that intergenerational engagement continues, wherein children are actually part of implementing the reforms and have a say in things that actually affect them. Implementation of the reforms is essential. As much as uh, we have been advocacy and also contributing to setting up of the legal framework. So, as an organization, we have set up social legal defense centers across the country to facilitate access to justice for children. Welcome to DCI Social Legal Defense Center. This is the place where children and their family come in to access services. Here, we listen to their complaint, develop case plan for them and manage their cases. We also help them access services like legal education, counseling, and also refer them for other services that DCI do not provide. Another important thing we do at DCI is we go to the courts and the police and we advocate for cases of children in conflict with the law to be diverted to our social legal defense centers for cases to be settled without resorting to criminal proceedings. With the support of Defense for Children International Sierra Leone and Legal Empowerment Fund, we the young people have established our own social legal defense centers in our communities. We monitor and report child rights abuse cases to the police, DCI, Ministry of Gender and Children's Affairs. And as well, we also advocate for children in conflict with the law to get justice and mercy. Usually, we mobilize and conduct youth meetings and also meeting with um, adult stakeholders to get essential um, legal transformation. And all this work, we do it under the supervision of DCI lawyers and we feel legally empowered.